the Buddha's awakening happened under a tree, sitting under a tree, a Bodhi tree. And before that, there were many practices, right? He, he lived a life as a prince and had, uh, you know, everything that the material world could offer him, he had, you know, whatever it was, this was what he had in his young life. And then something inside prompted him to, to go on a spiritual search. And when he did that, he went through many, many practices, great austerity, studied with different teachers. And, and at one point, he sat, he kind of like let go of all those practices and he just sat under the Bodhi tree. That's all. He just sat and he listened. He listened. But all those practices helped him be able to listen, helped him be able to not listen to his mind, not listen to all the, the thoughts and, uh, and, and knowledge and other things that he'd learned, even the spiritual knowledge, to just let all of that go and just listen, just be quiet enough to hear something else. And that something else was his awakened nature, which is in all of us. You know, so all the practices that we do, they're, they're, in a way, they're kind of like warm-ups. You know? They're like, uh, they're helping us prepare us for this, like an athlete, when he's going to be in a, you know, a baseball game or whatever, or running, he stretches, he does warm, warm ups, he does different things to loosen himself up so that when it's time to play, he can play well, he can play at his peak effort. He doesn't just run onto the field. He's warming up first. So to be able to play at his peak and, and he's been doing practices all his life. So all these practices that we do are like that. They're like a warm up and, and, uh, um, and training us for us to listen. To listen to this that's always in us. To be able to hear what's always been here. Because awakening is like that. Awakening, everyone experiences awakening as it's always been here. Oh my God, I've searched for so long for this and it's been here the entire time. Never from the moment you know, I was an infant. Has this not been here? All the time I've been suffering, it's been here. All the time I was confused, it was here. It's always been here. That's an amazing thing to be able to, to see that. I mean, and our reactions often are in, initially are just uh, hilarious laughing because it's so absurd in a way, you know, it's so simple. It's always been here. It's always been right here. 